music shop we talk a little pick a lot and we're live from oklahoma usa We're at the Oklahoma Music Shop here at the Oklahoma Music Hall of Fame with Jana Jay. Jana, we're excited to have you here. You got some new music, but right. I want to ask you a question about everybody knows you from Hee Haw. Right. Or a lot of people. Tell us about being on Hee Haw. Oh, that was so much fun, and we're going to have our own Hee Haw show right here tonight. Oh, I'm excited. You know, we're going to have you on stage, Barry Bones Patton on stage. Got a six piece band, they're all awesome. So we're going to have a great time and, and a little bit of a hee-haw feel, so it'll be fun. You know, it, it had to be a, a lot of fun working with Buck and Roy, and that had to be a major hit. We had Roy here, here a while back. He had great stories about hee-haw. Isn't What's he your great? Favorite? I hope he didn't tell stories on me. He told he us a lot of stories. Did he? <laughs> tell us your favorite story from hee -haw. Oh, gosh, I think it was, I was so shocked the first time I was on hee-haw. I thought it was a big audience, you know big auditorium. It was little studio, Channel 5 studio that had about 30 people out there. And it was mostly cast. Mm -hmm. And so it was a, a very, very small venue, but boy, it did a lot. You know, it was on for 26 years running. And uh, all the networks turned that down. And then they kept it in syndication. It ran for 26 years. Isn't that amazing? That is amazing.
G-Fest is the latest music festival sensation to sweep across Oklahoma. And it's all happening June 16th through the 18th, 2016 at Hatbox Field in Muskogee, Oklahoma. National headliners for this three-day G-Fest include Merle Haggard, the Avet Brothers, Turnpike Troubadours, Jason Boland and the Stragglers, Marty Stewart, Robert Randolph, the Swan Brothers, John Fulbright, Dirty Dozen Brass Band, the Quaby Sisters, Byron Burline Band, Uncle Lucius, Paul Thorne Band, and many more. RV hookups as well as tent sites are available adjacent to the festival site. Exclusive VIP passes are available while quantities last. Don't wait. Buy your G-Fest tickets today. www.gfestmuskogee.com. Buy your tickets now. Hey, it's Jimmy and Johnny, and we're right here at the Real Oki store, right next to the Greater Muskogee Area Chamber of Commerce. We're going to go in and check it out. Come go with us. Let's go check it out. Hey, we want to buy some Real Oki stuff. All right, let's go check it out. Hey, Johnny, they got some good stuff in here. Look, you can buy this for your wife or your girlfriend. Or how about you, Jim? All right. Your lineage is incredible. Your grandfather was a champion fiddle player. Yes, he was. But your parents went to Juilliard. That's right. So my my grandparents thought they would. Uh, granddaddy was a fiddle player. Grandmother was a pianist. But they wanted uh, mom to go to Juilliard and learn how to play the violin right because she knew fiddle tunes. But uh, they sent her to Juilliard, and she met my dad there. So when I was two, they gave me a little eighth size violin and I started playing violin. But I still had granddaddy's fiddle tunes, you know, 
in my lineage, like you said, and they, they uh, always were a great encore if I was doing classical music or uh, we always had so much fun. We had family jam sessions every night. The, the grandparents had a 40 acre farm in Idaho, which is where my folks still live. And um, every night after working outside on the farm, and I did a lot of that too, we'd come in and, and play music. So here's the Black Mountain Rag. I'm ready. I got everything we need for this road trip. Got plenty of CDs. What's with the get up? Well, you remember that celebrity guy I told you I'm pretty good friends with? Yeah. And I want him to make an appearance. Well, I guess we're not that good of friends. Ha! Let's go. This is Three Rivers Museum. You ever been here, Harley? Never been here. Hey, Johnny. This is Bass Rees, man. You ever seen his? This is cool, man. That's a realistic dummy. A real lawmaker back in the day. Wow. Yeah, that's really cool. That must be one of those animatronical correct dummies. It's a dummy, man. It was moving. Nah. What are you doing? I'm, I'm broadcasting live to the world. <laughs> it doesn't work. 
I, I, sure it works, watch. Come on down to the beautiful Three Rivers Museum in beautiful downtown Muskogee, Oklahoma. Is there a problem, you guys? Located in the heart of Oklahoma is a place where the stories, songs, and memorable performances of Oklahoma's native sons and daughters live on. Oklahoma has a rich history in music and continues to make a profound impact on the world's music culture and music industry today. From Wanda Jackson to Carrie Underwood and Blake Shelton, Oklahomans have created music that is famous around the world. Come experience Oklahoma's music from past to present. The Oklahoma Music Hall of Fame in the heart of Muskogee, Oklahoma is where the music lives on. And every week the stage comes alive with the Oklahoma Music Shop performances. Please go to omhof.com for live event schedules and to become a member of the Oklahoma Music Hall of Fame today. One of the biggest thrills I've got to experience in a long time um, was I'm going to the recording studio with you. You had oh. me singing a song, and while we're recording, you, you said, you know who this fiddle player is? I go, that's you. And you said, no, it's Curly Lewis. So you have this was Western so Swing fun. project. Yeah, here we are. I don't know if it's probably glaring, but Take Me Back to Tulsa is the name of this CD. And gosh, we had a lot of great players on there. We had horns. Uh, Mike Bennett and Steve Hamm and Spencer, Spencer, who will be here tonight, Spencer Sutton on keys, Pat, um, Pat Savage on guitar, and Danny McBride on guitar, and you, you brought oh. your guitar and your banjo and you sang so great, so we got to get you on stage tonight. Well, it was a big thrill. I love the CD, love the music, but being to record with Curly Lewis is the... And Curly, I know, that, that was the whole impetus for the CD, because he and I had recorded uh, about two, two years before his death, two or three years, and so we had these things in the can, and uh, I thought, we really need to recognize Curly. So it's really a tribute to Curly. We played Twins on Faded Love and Take Me Back to Tulsa and Milk Cow Blues. It's just awesome. And the engineer on this, he's no, he's no slouch. That's right, David Teagarden. He played drums with us on a lot of those tracks, mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, just great. Well, that's a cool project, and, and uh, where can people get this CD? Well, they can get it on uh, CD Baby, iTunes, uh, from me, Facebook, you know, it's all over. <laughs> Let's do a little Milk Cow Blues there, Jim. Sing it for us in a minute. Two, This morning, looked out my door, and I could tell my milk cow, I could tell by the way she looks. If you see my milk cow, please drive her on home. Cause I ain't had no milk and butter since my cow been gone. Well, you gotta treat me right, day by day. Get out your little prayer books Get out on your knees and pray You're gonna need me You're gonna need my help someday Yeah, you're gonna be wondering, honey You treat me this way Good evening, don't that sun look good going down? I said, well, good evening, don't that sun look good going down? Don't that old lolly car look lonesome? Your lover ain't around.
get along with you. Now I'm gonna tell you what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna stop my crying, leave you alone. If you don't think I'm leaving, Big Mama, just count the days I'm gone. You're gonna go with me. You're gonna miss my hair someday. Yeah, you're gonna be wondering, honey, you treated me this way. The National Fiddlers Hall of Fame is based yes. in Tulsa, Oklahoma. That's and right. You were inducted this year. That's right. How exciting that was. Congratulations. Thank you so much. Along with being inducted in the Oklahoma Music Hall of Fame. What a year. It's been a, it's been a big year. <laughs> it's been an incredible year. And uh, really do, uh, you know, I'm humbly honored, totally honored to be in those um, uh, it's being in tall cotton uh, to be on those rosters and be a member of the Oklahoma Music Hall of Fame is just a dream come true. And the National Fiddler Hall of Fame, that's not too slouchy either. <laughs> For more information, check us out online at oklahomamusicshop.com.